Park boys are known for their outrageous and sometimes illegal behavior. But now one of the stars of that show is in hot water over a police incident in downtown Barrie. This is comedian John Dunsworth, but you probably know him as Jim Leahy, the supervisor on the Trailer Park Boys who appeared in Barrie over the weekend. We did a great show there last night. But it was before the show here on stage at Yuck Yucks that caused some problems. The comedian was expected across the road for an autograph signing session. There was a line of fans that had gathered to get his autograph, and we'll let Dunsworth explain what happened at that point. I got out of the car, and I walked down the street, and I saw all these people, and I was walking down the street, and they were lined up, and there was a car. Actually, I came from like, like this. I saw the people, and there was a car like this. Without knowing the guy, without doing anything, I stepped up on the car, wah, like this. And then I went like this, and I went, ta-da! Barry police say Dunsworth surfed on top of the vehicle for about half a block like before jumping off. Then I went over and I said, hey, how you doing? I didn't see the policeman that was there. I didn't see the trouble that the driver got in. The traffic officer charged the 17-year-old unsuspecting driver of the SUV with stunt driving. He lost his license on the spot and the SUV was impounded. I was uh, really upset that I had caused him trouble and I promised I would help him handle the um, the consequence. This morning, Dunsworth and the 17-year-old met at the police station where the charge was reduced to careless driving. Still, though, a major fine that carries with it six demerit points if he's found guilty. Sergeant Rob Allen says the reduced charge is still warranted. He's responsible for the vehicle, the person's inside and on top of his vehicle, and he had an obligation to stop immediately. Uh, this is pretty much just from, like, down there and kind of right in here. And Eric Batters saw the whole thing happen. I mean, he was maybe on the car for a couple of seconds. It was nothing. It was really not something, you know, the car wasn't even really moving. So, I mean, I think it was a little bit blown out of proportion. I did stupid, right? And as my brother says to me, stupid sometimes hurts. As for the comedian, he wasn't charged, and police say he won't be, saying it's all the driver's responsibility. Now, I did speak with the mom of the 17-year-old by phone today. She claims her son didn't know anybody was on the roof, and as soon as he did, he stopped the vehicle.